My name's Zoe, I am a farmer in the southwest of Victoria, based out in Noranda South. Milk quality starts at the paddock when we go to bring our cows in. As soon as we head into that paddock, we're looking for any cows that aren't in their normal place. If a cow's the first cow out usually and she's hanging back till last, it sort of signifies to us that maybe she's not feeling great, she's not healthy. Uh, we're looking for any cows that maybe have a swollen quarter while they're coming in and we're looking for any lame cows or cows that are just unhappy in themselves. As we're coming down the track, we're looking for any problems on the track itself or nothing's come up from the subsurface of the track. Uh, as we get towards certain things like our underpasses or corners in the track, we're making sure that there's nothing that's been dragged across them or that our underpass isn't full. As they're coming into the yard, we're trying not to push them in. We're trying to let them come in nice and happily. Once they're in the shed, we're looking for any swollen quarters or maybe just a lot of dirt on the teats. Uh, if there's dirt, we're going to wash them and sanitise them before cupping on. If they're swollen, we're going to strip her out, have a look to see if there's any active mastitis. If there's nothing, we will mark her uh, for recheck in the morning, both by putting paint on her udder and also entering her in the computer so that when she comes on on the next milking, uh, the computer will set off an alert to notify us that someone has found something. Once they're heading out and after they're milked, every cow gets sprayed with an iodine-based teat spray. And as they head out, we try and keep our exits as clean as we can, just keeping all of their effluent hosed off it. Uh, letting them walk out at their own pace, not forcing them out and heading them out to a nice, clean, fresh paddock. The Cups on Cups Off course is fantastic. I've been lucky enough to do it twice and I would happily do it again and again. As the dairy industry discovers more things about cows, the course is updated. There's always new information and it doesn't matter who you are, there's always more to learn. The Cups on Cups Off course is for everyone, whether it's farmers, farm hands, backpackers, or even if you're just really interested in the industry and want a stepping stone in, it's a great way to meet people, it's a great way to get connections. If you're a farmer and you haven't done the course before, I would highly recommend doing it. And if you've done it, do it again. There's always new information. There's always new things to learn. And there's always a chance to better your education on cows and herd management.